Good day everyone. Hope you're doing well. Today we have an article from Inverse.com titled Star Wars 9 Theory May Reveal Kylo is Controlling Emperor Palpatine. If you like this kind of content, consider subscribing to the channel. It helps out a lot and it lets me know I'm doing an awesome job. But let's get into this. Emperor Palpatine is set to make a spectacular return in Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker. His comeback has prompted a deluge of fan speculation about the circumstances surrounding his return. Most of these predictions and leaks place Palpatine in the position of the ultimate puppet master. However, an intriguing new theory flips our expectations to claim it's Kylo Ren who's actually in control of Palpatine. We know that Kylo is now the supreme leader of the First Order after killing Snoke in The Last Jedi. One leak even implies that Kylo's in search of Snoke's power source at the beginning of Episode 9. But what if Palpatine's revival is actually a fake-out? Hans Zarkov Lives theorizes that Kylo isn't actually in search for Sheev Palpatine or Snoke's power source. In fact, Palpatine may not be the ultimate threat in The Rise of Skywalker after all. Instead, Kylo will realize that his leadership alone isn't enough to secure the loyalty of the First Order. This will prompt him to manufacture a fraudulent Palpatine to secure control and power. How would Kylo manage to do this if Palp's dead? According to the theorist, Kylo will create the image of the Emperor via a rumor, hologram, whatever, as a system of control. Someone else in charge that people will follow. There's something to be said for the idea that Kylo might be using the face of the Sith Lord of the Galaxy actually fears to consolidate his power. But why go to all the trouble of killing Snoke only to join forces with Palps immediately after? Palpatine's return would threaten Kylo's place in the First Order, and it's doubtful he'd willingly cede that power to someone else at this point. Kylo successfully manipulates people in the past, including Rey, so it's not that far-fetched to believe he'd use Palpatine as a means to attain the ultimate power. The theory also provides a clear workaround the Emperor's return since a fake Palps would avoid having to explain how the character survived the climatic battle that capped off Return of the Jedi. However, General Hux and other First Order brass might not see Kylo as a worthy leader so he might be desperate enough to execute plan B. Could it backfire? Big time. But think of how much power Ben Solo would have if Palpatine openly declared the rightful leader of the First Order. With Palp's blessing, the rest of the First Order might finally f see fit to follow Kylo's orders without question. The theory might also explain the MSW leaks about Sheev being hooked up to mechanical stuff. If he isn't the real Paps, then perhaps he needs the machinery to maintain the illusion. Regardless of whether it's Kylo or Palpatine in the driver's seat, the galaxy is in for a rude awakening come December. So what do you think about this article? Do you think that Kylo will be the one that's in charge and uh, giving orders to Palpatine? Do you think it will be Palpatine giving orders to Kylo? I don't know. I don't see Kylo giving orders to Emperor Palpatine. Um, but... It could be kind of interesting to have a hologram of the Emperor saying that Kylo is in charge. Um, that could work, possibly, for some anyways. But we, I think we've heard in some spoilers that General Hux is supposed to turn to the Resistance eventually. So maybe uh, he figures that the Emperor is a fake and goes to the Resistance. Uh, but who knows? Let me know what your thoughts are on this. I don't have it one way or the other, but I really don't think that Kylo would be in charge of Palpatine. But that's my thoughts. What are yours? Let me know in the comments section. And as always, take care and have an awesome day.